guys, it's me and Nisa, and today, finally, I will be doing an MV reaction to FX, Red Light. Um, I already heard the song, because I already listened to the album, and oh, this album is everything. Um, so, I'm really excited to see the music video. I don't know, I just, I would have did it, like, the day after, but, like, I don't know. I think I just got, like, super lazy. <laughs> And I didn't want to do it, but I need to do it. Because, <laughs> like, how long has it been since they put it out? Like, four days? I don't know. It's been a minute. <laughs> so, um, I'm really excited. I love this for them. They all look amazing. Oh, my God. Did you see Amber? Did you see Amber with the sun? And, oh, my gosh. She looked gorgeous. All right. Let's get it. Play. Turn down. Phone ringing. Bible burning. What's that? It's just a book. This whole album got me like this. <laughs> is that is she really holding a Bible though? Wait a minute. Crystal looks amazing. Yes, Sully! Yes, Luna. Slay this whole comeback, Luna. Yes, Vicky. Victoria is my bias, if you guys don't know. She looks freaking amazing. Like, whatever cult she is in, I want to join it. Only disappointing part about this song is this. This whole part here. Yeah. You see how S Oh Amber looks gorgeous. You see how like S got them out the box? Yes, Nika looks amazing. Oh my god, Amber looks so good. Oh my god, Amber looks amazing. Yes, Luna! Amber looks freaking oh! I just want to like kidnap Amber. Amber, stay with me. Kill that leg! Oh, she looks beautiful. Look at that, Becky. Amazing. They just all look so good. Sully hasn't had that much screen time. I can already tell you that right now. There you go, Sully. You better get out there. Ooh, look at Amber. Okay, there you go, Sully. Sully's so tall and gorgeous. Yes, stand in the middle, Sully. Amber looks freaking amazing with red hair. Being anywhere near the girly line. Oh my god, Sully looks good. Like, not girly, but like, Amber looks sexy in this music video. Like, Amber is freaking. Oh my god. Like, Amber may literally look sexy in this music video. She is so gorgeous. All of them are so gorgeous. Like, FX has just evolved so much. They burning Bibles? No, really, was that a Bible that she was burning? <laughs> Red lights. That album, the album is amazing. If you haven't seen the album, you need to listen to it. That music video was amazing. I can't even begin to, like, like, 
for once an FX in the finally did justice to the song. Like the song is a really, really, really good song. And like the MV was oh god, the MV was just amazing and they just all look so good. Like I don't even know what to say because like Sully, let's just talk about how gorgeous Sully is. Do you just like look look at Sully? Like Sully has really grown up into a gorgeous young lady. And then Crystal slaying like slaying people's lives with her blonde hair and you know crystal in the music video crystal looked absolutely awesome with her blonde hair but what performance was that i think they performed all night and she had her blonde hair and they had the little bobby pin and i did not like that i did not look because it literally like <laughs> Crystal with blonde hair can go 50-50. If it's styled beautifully and she's about to do like a photo shoot and or she's about to like shoot a music video or something, it looks gorgeous. But when she's on stage, it doesn't look as good. It literally like, have you ever seen like uh, a white girl with blonde hair and it's like not her natural hair color and it just, and she's like really pale and it just doesn't look good like at all and she almost looked like sick and she almost looks like sick and she's like skinny and like have you ever seen one of those white girls i mean this isn't to be racist this is just an example but have you ever seen one of those like she's like thin and you know kind of pale and then she's got blonde hair and it just doesn't look good at all that's what it looked like in the live performance and i was just like no don't do Anyway, Vicky, Vicky looks amazing, my bias looks awesome, she always looks awesome. She looked amazing, her teaser pictures were really stunning because her hair was all curly and stuff. And Luna is, oh my god, Luna is in charge of this comeback first of all. She's rocking the short hair, the blue and the green and the eyes and then the, ah, uh, Luna just looked amazing in this music video, she just looks so classy. Which Luna always looks classy, like, SM always knows how to do Luna in an Amber. The moment I saw Amber's teacher picture, when she had the long side bang, and she had the eye makeup, and she just looked gorgeous. She looked so sexy in that teacher picture. And in this music video, Amber with her red hair, and the earring and the eye makeup. I think it's the eye makeup that's doing it with Amber. Like they got this nice heavy eye on her and it just looks amazing. Like she looks so sexy with the eye makeup on. And I, I really think it's the eye makeup and red is a really good color for her. It's, it's her makeup. It's, it's definitely her makeup because Amber, you know, we know Amber as the silliest girl in the world. Like, Amber is so silly, and she really, um, has that tomboy image. Even in the music video, like, she wasn't wearing what everybody else was wearing. Like, her shorts were a little bit longer and a little bit baggier, and so was her shirt. And, you know, they always dress her, um, as, like, a, you know, a tomboy. The tomboy figure that cannot outshadow her makeup. I mean, <laughs> outshadow, outshine her makeup and her hair and her whole entire face just look sexy. So... I like this Amber, continue to do this. <laughs> oh, man, I just love this. I listened to the album yesterday. If you haven't listened to this album, you're missing out on legit life. You just need to listen to this album because it is life itself. If you have not listened to this album, you are dead. Once you listen to it, you become alive. Because this album, like, this came out the blue. Nobody was ready for this album. Nobody. As soon as the first, well, I don't even know what the first song is. I think it's Red Light. And then you go on. And the next song is Butterfly. And then what's after, ow. What's after Butterfly? Or is now? I think the second song is Milk. And then I think the third song is Butterfly or vice versa. And then number four. That's eight. Number four. I can't. I just 
just because when you listen to Rainbow, like you just start twerking, like with no warning signs, no nothing. Like you don't even know that you're doing it, but you are. That's how Rainbow is. Anyway, man, this comeback is just amazing. Like, SM really treats FX like that stepchild. And, like, they just don't care for FX at all. No fan name, no concert, no nothing. Why EXO already having a freaking solo concert thing? But FX over here just getting treated like the stepchild. But the one thing that SM never messes up on with S FX is their music. Because, like, this album is literally like pink tape all over again. All over again. You can just literally just sit there and let the whole album play. Like, every song on this album is so good. It's just, like, why FX always gets the good songs? I don't know, but it gets treated like crap. It will forever be a mystery. But continue dishing out these good songs, okay? Because this... Red Light is the album of 2014. Like, this is the best album of 2014, hands down. It goes beyond 21's Crust. It goes beyond School Love Affair. Like, this album is amazing. So, if you haven't listened to it, please go listen to it. You guys can follow me on Twitter. You guys can follow me on Tumblr. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye. This song brings out the rest of us.